Celtics, good afternoon and good afternoon to your families as well. First and foremost, the staff here at Bishop McDonnell are hoping and praying that you're well and that hopefully you found some calm and relaxation over the March break. In light of the rapid changes in our society due to the COVID-19 situation and with the likelihood that school closures will continue beyond the two weeks that were initially announced, I'm sure you have questions and I'm sure you have concerns about the plan forward. I just want to first assure you of this. All parties involved, including all employees at the Wellington Catholic District School Board, the Ministry of Education, the Ministry of Colleges and Universities, are all on the same side and that is of supporting students through this difficult time and are all working to ensure that graduation and students' plans for post-secondary are not disrupted in any way. In terms of learning continuity, we're working on plans to move forward. Currently, the province is in phase one, which is to make some learn at home resources available. While under phase one, which will likely go until April the 5th, the Ministry of Education is working with the school boards, who of course will also work with the teachers to develop phase two. As we know more about what phase two will look like, we'll communicate it further. Our advice to all students is to use this time to review all the content covered so far and ensure that all assignments and tasks have been, that have been given up to this point in the semester are complete. It's actually pretty rare that we have an opportunity such as this to stop and master all that we've learned thus far. The Learning at Home link, along with the page of, page of resources by the Toronto District School Board, are gonna be included in the description portion of this uh, YouTube announcement. We also encourage students to practice their self-regulation and initiative skills to reach ahead in their courses using these and other resources. This is a difficult time for our society and perhaps especially difficult for teenagers who are hardwired with a need for social connection. Please, we encourage you to be physically active. Get some fresh air in a safe way, of course, that ensures physical and social distance and reach out to friends online in positive ways. Please also remember all the many blessings that we have in our lives and remember that this time shall pass. Within time, we will all once again be able to do the things that we love. In the meantime, we encourage personal growth and positive use of time. We live in an age where we have resources at our fingertips. You can learn a language, learn a musical instrument, find new ways to exercise, you can find ways to better yourself. Above all, during this time, take care of yourself and take care of others. We'll be in further contact soon. Be well.